Ah, uh, yes, hi. Uh, my name is Joseph Krasaya. I had called you a couple of weeks ago about some issues I was having. Yeah. Okay. Did you get any in any more information about the problems? Um, hold on. Let me um, walk over and see. Hold on. Okay, no problem. Thank you. Okay, yes, hi. I'm back, I'm back. Um, I'm trying to find a supervisor to speak to. A supervisor, okay. Um, I, I'm, sure, I'm sorry, a supervisor of which department? Of appeals, uh, of complaints. Okay, okay. Can you tell me, um, as you know, uh, I like to see uh, information about my privacy, and I want to know... Uh, who has this information, the names that you know of that have this information? Because I sent it to you, and you are Jane, last name? Yes. Your last name? Hunt. Jane Hunt, okay. So I sent it to you, and this is the most recent complaint. And the other complaint I sent to the other office, attention, Tim. Do you know, do you know Tim's last name? Uh, that might be. No, I'm not sure if it was Okay, okay. At least, uh, okay. At least that you know of. Can you tell me the full names of all the people who have my information? Um, it's, it, hold on a minute. Okay. Um, I'm trying to find it. Um, okay. I know, because you don't have to be a doctor to answer this one. And you don't have to read an EKG, yeah. right? Yeah. Right. So it's much, it's, it's a much easier question. No, I mean, no, I know, I, I, do, I do understand who you forwarded, but can you give me the names of all the individuals who have uh, any of these matters that you know of? So, I know one name is Renee. What is Renee's last name? Okay, hold on, let me, hold on. Okay, 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 okay. I just need full names. I mean, this is simple stuff. You said you could not read an EKG, but I'm not asking you to read an EKG. Because I'm trying to find out the track of who has my information, so it's going to get very important to answer that question. And ultimately, I'm going to get subpoenas to find out who has it, so I hope you're telling the truth, right? Hello? Okay, hello? Hey, sorry, sorry. I had to hold for a minute. Okay, I, I'm trying. I'm wondering why do you have to put me on hold to find out who has my information? That kind of stuff should be on your system. It doesn't require any kind of discussion or analysis or calling somebody else. You can just tell me who who do you know that has my information? Mr. Krasaya. Yes, ma'am. Hi. Um. This is uh, Carol. Yeah. I'm um the supervisor here. Um. I'm. Need to find out exactly what um, you need, and okay. we're going to try to help you uh, get what you need. Okay. Now, what I need, I mentioned already earlier, but right now, at this particular time, since. I when I was making requests that you really had to answer, you didn't. But at this point, the request is going to be, I want to know the names of all the individuals who have my information that you know of, that Jane Hunt know of. Now, your name is... Right. I'm sorry, your name, uh, your name is... I'm sorry. We're taking notes that we will... Uh, make sure that you get information. So you are looking to see who has access or who has access to your medical 
no, 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 no. That's not the question. The the question is, once I sent my most recent complaint to Jane Hunt, um, after that point, I need to have the list of, now the first name is Jane Hunt, she received it. I need to have the names of all the other individuals who have uh, any contact, any knowledge about any parts of the information, not just my medical records. So, so one is Jane. So, so I, involvement in the complaint that you registered with uh, Ms. Hunt. I'm sorry? You need to know that you are asking for any individual who has been involved exactly. in the uh, complaint that you No, 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 no. I'm, I, I'm asking any individual who has been involved with my name or any of the information that I sent in. So they could not have, you know, it doesn't have to be them dealing with that complaint. They could have been dealing with anything. Anyone who has my, in I think that's the simple question because when I asked Jane Hunt. That's, uh, um, unless I have specifics because we have a computer system here that lists all of our members in it. Okay. Anyone who would get a call from you. Okay. Okay. Now you. Okay. Okay. Right. 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 I'm sorry. I didn't get your name. Your Carolyn last name. Atia. Atia. Okay. Okay. Can you tell me all the individuals that you have discussed the matter with, either by voice or by writing? I will um, contact our person. Um, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This seems to be a fairly easy question. Yes, I need to, because... I, Mr. Kruzai, I'm going to have to end the call and then have someone call you back. Now, the reason for that, no, because here's the point. I mean, if someone calls me back, then we know it's been discussed and you're not telling me the truth. Uh, I need you to tell me... It's not true. We uh, uh, take a lot of pride in the work that we do and we try to take very good care of our members. Okay, so why is... Okay, I, I know, I know. I want to know who did you speak to about my matter? Or who did you write to about my matter? So you don't have to answer for anybody else. Just just give me the names of the individuals that you have spoken. It's very important that I know this 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 privacy information. And it seems that if you need time, then it seems like just like everything else your office has been doing, you're going to go back and commit fraud. So it's very important to give... I'm going to end the call right now because we do not commit fraud out of this office. But I already proved it. Okay. Give you a call back. Um, okay, why can't I have that information? With you. We have what you're looking for. And uh, is there a number that they can reach you at? Okay, you said you have what I'm looking for. What is it I'm looking for? Is there a number that they can reach you. I know. Um, you do realize some of this matter is in court. So uh, I, I don't... I'm you is somebody's going to give you a call back. Is there a number that they can reach you? If somebody's going to give me a call back about what matter? The matter that you just asked of who um, has had access uh, to any uh, information regarding to any of your requests. Right. But then I asked you, right, then I asked you a more specific question about... A, a number that we can reach you at. Otherwise, oh. I'm going to assume that the number that we have in our system... Do you have CCMS pulled up? Do you have it? Um, I just want but but here's the issue. I'm I'm asking you. Who do you know that you have right. given this information to? Okay. Is the number that we can reach you at? Is it two four zero four seven five seven seven three seven? Um, that's going to be me. But I think at this point, when you are contacting me, you know, I'm working with an attorney now. So uh, I think you'll have to call my attorney. Attorney's name, if you'd like us to go through the you. Right, exactly. So at this point, uh, I can't let you know exactly uh, when the attorney is going to get in touch with you. But the attorney wanted me to try if I can get it because I have my privacy rights. And so when I asked you the question... Can you disclose your attorney's name? The reason I cannot is the attorney wanted me to get the information because this is something I can do on my own, which is okay. which is my privacy rights. And so, so what I'm going to do, Mr. Kazaya, I'm going to um, speak with our legal 
legal department as well. And then somebody will be giving you a call back. Okay. But... No, 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 no. You cannot call me back at this point because you didn't. I need. I need you to answer whatever you can on this phone call. We're gonna have someone give you a call back. And and um, and, and when will they call me? If when they call you back, you want them instead of talking with you. Right. Yeah. Actually, I don't. You know. Okay. We can do that. Okay. Well. Okay. I'll tell you who they. The okay, here's who they can call back. Okay, let me give you the. Okay, okay, let me give you the phone number of who you can call. Ah, uh, yes. Can I speak to Hannah? Can I speak to Hannah? Yes. I'm actually not in right now. Okay. Can I speak to Dr. McCarthy? He's busy with the patient, but if you give me your name. Okay. Okay. Do you know, uh, can you, I don't know if you can interrupt him for just a minute. I, um, my name is Joseph Krasaya. I came on Saturday to see him. And he wanted me to call and talk to him about something for like a minute. Okay. Um, give me one second, okay? Sure, no problem. Yes. Can he call you back? I think he's eating right now. Oh, can I just pause talk to him for like 15 seconds? Yeah, one second. Okay, thank you. Mr. Yes. Yeah, he's really busy right now. Okay, can you, you Okay, can you uh stay on hold with me and just get me an answer from him? or what you have on your system. Now this is what it's going to be. I need to know, since I was a patient of Dr. McCarthy, um, your office, a list of names that you have contacted with regard to any of my issues. So it's like a privacy issue. I want to know the full names of uh, who's been contacted. So I guess you have that in your system. You can get that. I, I was just trying to see if they can get it for me better, but I guess you should have. Okay, can I talk to him? I, I know, I need this information right now. But he's actually busy. He's eating. Okay, can you just ask him and get the information from him? Or, would you, right, would you have that in your system? I mean, shouldn't that be in your system? I'm sorry? I'll check, okay. Right. Wouldn't that be in your system? I want to know the names, the full names of, you know, who you have contacted. That's, that's going to be very important. Yes, hello? Hi, 
Yes, yes. Uh, I was calling because I'm a patient there. I was trying to find out a list of names that have my information outside of your office. A list of names that have your name? No, that have my information from your office. So I've been dealing with Dr. McCarthy and Hannah, the practice manager. I need to know a list of names that they have. I guess that should be in your computer, right? Because I have to give authorization for whoever you contact. Yes, uh, Miss Hannah's not in right now. She has to call it a little bit later when she comes back. But, okay, is that information in your system? I believe so, but she's the one who checks it. Okay, can you check it for me, please? I mean, if you have it in your system, I just need to get a list of names. So, and I'll be set after that, so I don't have to speak to them. Because I think that's information you have in your system that's basic privacy information. So it really doesn't have to do with any kind of medical issue. I want to know uh, who they have you know, spoken to about any of my issues. That's very important. Because you know, it looks like some of my information has gone to different places that it wasn't supposed to. So I'm trying to track it down. But if I can just get, if I can get a list, and I'll be okay yeah, with that. Call back in like about an hour. No, no, I'm sorry. I mean, you said you have it in your system, and you should be able to yeah, give it to me. Who it. I'm sorry. She's the one who looks at it. Do you have access to it? No, she does. No, I mean, is it like locked out by a code or something? I believe so. You need to be override and stuff, though. So. Okay. Can you just check with Dr. McCarthy? You said he was eating a few minutes ago. It's going to be very important because I'm actually getting in touch with an attorney. And it's very important that he answer, you know, who's gotten my information. You're on hold right now? Mom. Yeah, absolutely. Go ahead. Go ahead and just put me on hold and just get me Dr. McCarthy. Okay, hold on. It's going to be very important to get the information right now. Uh, yes, hello? I'm still here. <laughs> yes, sir. Hello? Yes, hello? Hello? Yeah, hi. Hi, how are you doing? Okay. I'm sorry, but the office is a little busy right now. If you can call back and leave. Oh, no. It's so important because I know you have the system. I know you're supposed to have, I, I know the rules. You're supposed to have the information in your system, and it doesn't require any of their authorizations. You know, you can give it to me. It's a, it's a privacy issue. I mean, the only issue is, you know, who that the doctor or the practice manager, anyone in your office has discussed any of my matters with because we know the privacy laws. And uh, I want to see what, what the variance from that is. 
and who has it because it's very important because I know some people got my information and who were not supposed to get it but uh, you know I don't know exactly how it went from which office so uh, if Dr. McCarthy will just tell me who he's given my information to then that would settle the issue I I'll take him at his word, so I'm not going to ask for any kind of proof. He can just tell me, or you can tell me what the list of names are. Okay, so okay, so so just go ahead and and give me like a list of names, and I'll take your word for it. I'm sorry, it has to be override. What? Okay. Can you ask? I mean, can can he do it from his system? He can just override, and you can get that information. Yes, sir. But he's currently busy. Right. Uh, I know, but I need my information. It's it's very important. I need to know it right now because I need to take action like right now about what happened. So so it's so it's so it's a very important matter that needs to get dealt with because here's the problem, if. Your office is going to delay it, you know, when I'm speaking back to my attorney, then that's going to make it look worse, like as though you're hiding something. So if you can just give me a list, I'll just take your word for it, whatever the names are. So I'm not going to call you after that, but I need the names so I can find out who else, because I know so somebody else could have given out the information as well. So. Okay, because, right, right, so just, yeah, just get in touch with Dr. McCarthy or Hannah, see if they can just come to the phone. Ms. Hannah is currently out of the office, I told you that earlier. Okay. I don't know what time she's going to be back, if you call back in an hour, maybe. Wow, yeah, I mean, yeah, here's the thing, right, because I'm trying to get, I, I, right, I'm trying to get the information right now, and actually what my attorney said is that, anyone in the office should be able to give me the information there's no such thing as any authorization needed because this is not this is not asking any kind of medical question this is asking a issue about you know my privacy rights and who the doctor or anyone in the office has discussed my matters with so that's simple stuff which should be in your system right so uh, I like for you to just Give me all the names. And I don't think you need any kind of override. Did someone tell you you need an override? Well, I'm currently new, so I need an override. Wow, there's nobody else on the front desk who can do that? They're currently assisting the doctor, so. Okay, so when you mean override, you can't even get into the screen? Correct. Okay, but you can get other parts of the screen, but this part of the screen is private. And so this is where the doctor would be if he made contact with someone in an unauthorized manner, he would hide that information so you could not give it to me. What do you mean? So if I authorize the doctor to make contact with four people and the doctor made contact with four other people also, who I did not give any authorization to, the doctor could the doctor could hide that information in the system, and you could not access it. But you know, I'm I'm wondering why is the information being hidden? Because it's it's supposed to be. I'm asking you. You know, this is a kind of question can which. Can you put you on hold for a minute? Sure. Yeah. If you can just get somebody to answer my phone or my question. Thank you. Uh, yes, hello? 
Oh yes, hi, how are you doing? Um, I was trying to get my privacy information. What happened is I think some people got my information who were not supposed to get my information. So I'm trying to get a list of names of full names of people who uh, you know the doctor or anyone in your office had contact with. Your information right because I only the only doctor I requested that your office get records from was Dr. Luke OK but other than that uh, I didn't give authorization to communicate with anyone so I need to get a list of names that someone has communicated and when I spoke to the person who answered before she said that information is in the system it's just that she doesn't have access to it she has to override it or someone else has to override who has authorization to override so I just need like the usual privacy information just a list of names so it's not like a medical question that the doctor has to answer it's just I want to know who has my information Okay, Our, information is in the system. Right, so, right. So, so what I want to know is any of the information which, you know, with regards, which is regarding me, um, you know, who it has been talked to or discussed with. Yeah, it's Miss Hannah. Okay, so the only... She's, she's in charge of this place. Okay, so so. Okay, so it, it doesn't say anywhere in your system, uh, because I know because because here's the here's the situation when when you discuss it, you know, Miss Hannah or anyone cannot go and discuss my matter with anybody else without my authorization, and my authorization has to be in writing. So okay, you t you talk about authorization about what? Authorization to discuss my matter or to get my records or do anything. You know, you okay, you, you yes, understand the yes, privacy yes, rules that I that understand. right, right, right. So they cannot discuss want, my matter. You want the kind of information you have to talk to Miss Hannah. Okay, she's in charge in this place. Oh. Okay. Give it to you the information yes later. Me or other inmates. We have like a three or four inmates working here. Uh, okay. Uh, number okay. Number is Miss Hannah. Uh, the uh, right, 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 right. But but the actually I'm not really asking for anything that hard. I think it's just what you have in your system, what it shows, uh, who I gave authorization to discuss or because they're not supposed to discuss it with anyone I don't give authorization to. So that should be simple, right? It's just who I gave authorization to in the system. Do you, do you give it to somebody? You remember who you give it to? The authorization. Right. The only authorization I ever gave your office to get any of my records for for was from Dr. Luke OK. So Dr. Luke OK. Dr. Luke OK is he now here. He's a different office, you know that? Right, right, right. So I gave so I gave your office authorization to contact him. But okay. but I didn't give your office authorization to contact anybody else. Zero. I understand. So uh, so so so. Th so we have somebody else on the system. Yes, Mr. Mr. Luke. Right, 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 right. So so Mr. Luke uh, is that is Luke his first name or Luke is his last name? Uh, I think Luke is the first name. Okay, you all just call him Mr. Luke. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Actually, we don't know because he's, he's a doctor. We transfer to refer to them, to him, the patients. Nothing else. We don't have other communication with him. Oh, okay, 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 okay. But, we but I, I know. So, so right, so right. So, so, so his matter is okay with me, because here's the problem. Somebody else got my information, and I need to know right away how it went over whether now I think it may have gone from somebody else who gave it in an unauthorized manner but I want to know if by some mistake or something it went out from Dr. McCarthy's office because I didn't give Dr. McCarthy authorization to discuss my issues with anybody so right so uh, actually if you can do this for me uh, I'm not going to answer my phone call when Hannah calls me back but okay. you, but you do but but no 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 uh, right so can you ask Han Miss Hannah to give me a call back this afternoon because she's not here right right is she coming back today I'm not sure 
but I'm, I'm soon I'm gonna I'm gonna see her. I'm gonna tell her, okay? Okay. So when do you think you'll see her? Like this afternoon? I'm not sure, sir. Okay, okay, okay. So, right, right, right. So, so, so here's the thing. If you can ask Miss Hannah or Dr. McCarthy to write down a list of names that they have discussed anything to do with me, because it's like a privacy question. So if they, right, right. If if they can write down a list of names, and then if they can email that to me. Okay, I don't know how that's gonna work, but you have to talk to me, Hannah. Okay, if they right, right now. You, you wanna, you have to talk to me, Hannah. Oh, okay. So, okay. if she can either email it to me or if she can just call my phone number, and phone because number. my phone number. But I want her to leave a message on my phone number because I because I know what's happening. If I call back later, she's not going to be there. Whatever. So if she can get me a list, my phone number is two four zero. 475 okay. 7737 7737 right 2404757737 and so my name is Joseph Krusaya last name is C R U S S I A H and and you know you know I really don't need to discuss with her. I I think she just needs to give me a list of names, and she can go ahead and leave it as a voicemail for me. That will make it quick. So because I think if I if I get the message and I call her back, then she's going to be gone again. So you, you know. Sure, sir, but soon I'm gonna see her. I'm gonna give it your name and your phone number. She's gonna call you, okay? Okay, so so when you see her, can you give her the message too that I want to get those names? So that's the message. Okay, so okay. so. I think you wanna you wanna talk to her. When she wanna call you, tell her everything, okay? But yeah, I think you're yeah, right. So if you can just pass that message along, so she can get a head start, yeah. because I think then it's gonna take longer. So if she can just get that, and she can just give me that list of names, that would be really good. If I can get that list of names, I'll be set, and she can just leave that on my voicemail. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, bye.